When playing with a metronome, you should practice playing quarter notes, eighth notes, sixteenth notes, and even triplets if you were, can do all of those other subdivisions. So if we play the quarter note here, and we're just playing a spider walk, I'll go, I'll work my way down on the spider walk, starting on the ninth fret. This comes around playing quarter notes here. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So I want to land directly, play a note when the metronome is making a noise. Not right before it, not right after it right at the exact same time. And you might ask, well, how do you feel that, that quarter note pulse? How do you not get ahead of it or behind it? Well, a way to do that is to count, and to count the, the space in between as well. Counting that space in between will definitely make you feel that, that quarter note pulse even, uh, even more. Okay, so I didn't think I even really played that well, uh, that quarter, that quarter note spider walk. Even that I was going that slow, I was still kind of not hitting right on the downbeat there. But now let's see what happens if I count the eighth note as well. So I'm going to count one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two. And and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. Okay, so that is counting the eighth note. But if I were to play the eighth note, Spider Walk, so I'm going one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. So that is how you play with the metronome and just one example of how you play with eighth notes over the spider walk.